Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Lil Tay dead at 14, mystery surrounds death of controversial social media star rapper and her brother Jason Tion, 21, as former manager sheds serious doubt on family statement and cops say they have no record of either passing. The death of 14-year-old influencer and rapper Lil Tay, whose real name was Claire Hope, has become shrouded in mystery after her former manager shed serious doubt on a family statement, confirming the passing the teen and her 21-year-old brother Jason Tion. The news of her sudden and tragic passing was announced by an unnamed family member in a post on the teen's Instagram account today, although the person or persons who shared it did not reveal their identity. But now the controversial social media star's former manager Harry Sang has called into question the legitimacy of the post, which did not reveal a cause of death as cops in both Vancouver, Lil Tay's place of birth, and Los Angeles, where she had been living with her mother, told DailyMail.com they had no record of her or Jason's deaths. Lil Tay became embroiled in furious controversy in 2018 amid allegations that she was being physically and mentally abused by her father as well as being exploited by her brother, with her mother also losing her job as a real estate agent over the youngster's content. The statement shared earlier today, which did not reveal the cause of death, began, It is with a heavy heart that we share the devastating news of our beloved Claire's sudden and tragic passing. We have no words to express the unbearable loss and indescribable pain. This outcome was entirely unexpected and has left us all in shock. Her brother's passing adds an even more unimaginable depth to our grief. The statement went on to reveal that both Tay and her brother Jason's deaths are still under investigation. During this time of immense sorrow, we kindly ask for privacy as we grieve this overwhelming loss as the circumstances surrounding Claire and her brother's passing are still under investigation, it continued. Claire will forever remain in our hearts, her absence leaving an irreplaceable void that will be felt by all who knew and loved her. Speculation has begun circulating on social media about the cause of deaths with one user, Jesse Ryan, claiming to have witnessed the incident. He wrote, As someone who was at the scene, I can confirm that both were together when passing. Due to car collision. The brother was driving. Local officials are speculating texting and driving being the cause. The other vehicle occupants were okay with minor injuries. Some followers have even gone as far as to suggest that the post was a hoax, while Lil Tay's former manager Harry Singh added further confusion when he released a cryptic statement about the news, refusing to confirm that the rapper had in fact died. In an email to DailyMail.com, Singh said that he had been in communication with individuals who have an intimate understanding of the family's situation but that he was still unable to definitively confirm or dismiss the news that Lil Tay and her brother had passed. Given the complexities of the current circumstances, I am at a point where I cannot definitively confirm or dismiss the legitimacy of the statement issued by the family, he said. This situation calls for cautious consideration and respect for the sensitivities involved. Meanwhile local authorities in Vancouver, where Lil Tay's father lives, and Los Angeles, where she had been living with her mother, had no record of any investigation into the deaths of Claire or her brother Jason when contacted by DailyMail.com. Lil Tay's lawyer father, Christopher Hope, declined to comment when contacted by DailyMail.com. He and the social media star seemingly had a strained relationship, with Lil Tay herself claiming she did not have a father figure in a tribute to rapper XXXTentacion, following his death in 2018. Her brother Jason had previously set up a GoFundMe page in a bid to raise $19,000 for Lil Tay after leveling allegations of physical and mental abuse against Hope and his wife, Honey. Attempting to explain Lil Tay's absence online, Jason, who is not Hope's son, wrote, My sister Tay has been silent on social media for the past three years because her absentee father, Chris Hope, served my mother a court order demanding control over Tay's money, career, and custody, and as a result it was court-ordered that my sister had to return to Vancouver, Canada. He also requested through a court order to prevent her from speaking out about the truth. Jason then claimed that Hope had stolen millions of dollars from the rising star for his own benefit. Following the allegations, Harry Sang, a spokesperson for Hope, 
told the Daily Beast in 2018 that the father did not want any money from his daughter, despite trademarking Lil Tay, arguing it was obvious that her mom hadn't taken any steps to do things in a businesslike manner. There are only three things he wants to see, Sang said. First, no more crazy videos of cursing from Tay. Second, 25% of the gross earnings going to a trust fund dedicated to Tay. The third thing is, there has to be structure in her operation, in her public image. In an interview with the publication about her online presence, Lil Tay said, Right now I'm in a bad situation and I don't want to talk about these things. When prompted for further clarification, she simply responded, with Chris Hope, before adding, it's obvious he just came back because he wants money. It had also previously been revealed that Lil Tay's mother, Angela Tian, had worked as a real estate agent in Vancouver, Canada, but lost her job after letting her daughter flex in the employee cars as well as the homes she was supposed to be showing to other clients. Lil Tay had previously sparked serious concern among her fanbase after she deleted all of her social media posts and wrote the words help me on her Instagram story. She has been noticeably absent from social media in the recent years, with her last post on the platform being in honor of rapper XXXTentacion, real name Yase Onfroy, who was shot dead aged 20 in 2018. It read, X you truly changed me. You were there for me when everyone wanted me to fail you were there to give me advice, you were there. As a father figure, when I don't have one, you were here, facetiming me and calling me for hours when I'm down. I can't believe this, the evil in the world, this isn't goodbye. I love you bro. In May 2018, it was claimed that the young girl was actually being exploited by older brother Jason after a series of videos came out that showed him coaching her on what to say in her controversial posts and clips, with one capturing him giving her an instruction to be more ignorant. After the videos emerged online, Lil Tay's Instagram and YouTube accounts were quickly scrubbed, prompting speculation that the pressures of the spotlight had become too much for her and her family to handle. A spokesperson for the family told BuzzFeed News at the time that Lil Tay's brother was rebranding her and urged fans to stay tuned for future updates on the young star. Lil Tay, who was originally from Canada but moved to Los Angeles as a young child, garnered viral fame after she began posting videos in 2017 aged just nine. Her controversial clips showed her cussing, insulting passers-by flashing stacks of cash and even starting fights as she claimed to be the youngest flexor in the century and above the haters. She had previously posted videos using language like an asterisk 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 asterisk, p asterisk 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 asterisk, and c asterisk 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 to spark interest in her content and had later appeared on Good Morning America with her mother to defend her image. But, despite the critics, Lil Tay quickly racked up more than 3.3 million followers on Instagram alone and had been pegged as one of the internet's biggest rising stars. Source, DailyMail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.